Hey guys, welcome back to more Assassin's Creed 2. Uh, I did clear out most of the towers. Uh, and... I take care of my notoriety. Okay, where is this? Okay, there it is. So guys, this is the... Uh, I'm guessing this is the last... No, this is the second last... Uh, key that I'm supposed to take care of. I hope it's not a timed one. I've done most of the two timed ones, uh, I've forgotten which one this is. But the intent obviously is to create more entertainment guys. I think this is a timing based. Or it's not, I don't think so, it's a timing based. I'll try to keep it as short as possible. That makes sure basically the videos are. Hmm. So I'll have to run into a lot of Raju over here. Yeah. On him. I'm sure. Raju, where do you think you're going? Raju is taking care of you. Oh, one more. Where have I seen it? Eccolo! There! Eccolo! There! Okay, so three guys taken care of. Oh, what the fuck is this? Is this supposed to only help me get all of the pace? Yes, I think so. Fucking. The number of mosquitoes that are there in this place. Sorry for the shoddy camera work. Okay, so you cannot go over there. I think you're supposed to go up here. And then go there. Go there, go there. Fucking shit, the number of mosquitoes, man. <coughs> yep, yeah, that's more like it. Cape of Venezia. Oh, I could have climbed right from here as well. Stupid of me! Stupid of me! Okay, let's go up there. Raju! Oh, Raju's been taken care of. Sorry guys, I had to kill him.
Okay, there's nothing over here. Uh oh, uh oh. These are a few of the tough guys. Okay guys, uh, I don't know if you saw the trailer of Kick-Ass. Uh, I'm sorry, I don't know if you've seen the trailer of Bhavesh Joshi. It's a new Bollywood movie. It's come out. It's going to come out on the 25th of May. Yep, all three of them successfully neutralized. I'm not escaping. Come here if you want to kill me. Oh, you cannot come here. God, and so like I said, the the trailer of Bhavish Joshi's come out, and for an Indian film, it looks pretty amazing. The concept is around superheroes. I mean, obviously, he's not super powered, but uh, but yes, uh, his ability to go and create a change is absolutely amazing. And I like the concept, you know, it, it is somewhat similar to the movie Kick-Ass. Okay, I have to go up there. Stupid. Came all the way over here just to come back full circle. So like I said, it's somewhat similar to the movie Kick-Ass. Uh, the motivations of the characters are a little different. I mean, in Kickass, he basically. That was scary. Raju! Yeah, like you said in the movie Kickass. Oh, what the fuck am I supposed to do over there? Is there something over here? No. Yes, there is. What is that up there? What? Chest over here. So, uh, the motivations of Kekas were totally different. He obviously uh, couldn't feel pain. And uh, he was just a teenage boy trying to become a superhero. In this case, even these guys are trying to become heroes by fighting against corruption, but then something goes terribly wrong. They mess up with the wrong people. Fucking shit, the mosquitoes! They mess up with the wrong people and... Suddenly one of them... is killed. You should 
Eccolo! There! There! Eccolo! You will not leave here! Damn! Cut him off! Yeah. And uh, for all its, uh, I think this guy Harshwadan Kapoor uh, really pulls off the role really well. And I was ex was expecting that the whole superhero concept will be a little corny in India, but uh, they made a good costume. The only couple of things that I was a little skeptical about was the action sequences uh, where there's one scene where he's fighting against two people and uh, it seemed a little naturally slow oh fuck Uh, one of the Rajus is down. Oh, both of them are down. <laughs> yeah, so like I said, uh, I hope it's a good movie. I hope it does well and really opens up the concept of uh, superheroes, not in a corny way, but in a way which basically actually makes sense in the Indian society's context. And I think this is a great start. Eventually, obviously, I would want uh, uh, erstwhile heroes from comic books, uh, the primary of which being Nagraj. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Oh! Where the fuck did I fall down to? Hey! It's here. Okay, I'm supposed to go there. Yes, like I said, superheroes like Nagraj, Super Commander Dhruv. They are obviously childhood heroes and uh, I'm saying if handled correctly, uh, I'm sure they'll be great. They shouldn't be made into co corny characters like the Superman, Hindi Superman movie that was released way back in the 90s. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Fuck! That was scary. <laughs> <laughs> the reason I laugh like this is because I think in one of the movies, Penguin used to laugh like this. It was really hilarious. I think it was the Adam West series. And there was a villain called... Uh, uh, Egg-headed villain. I forgot the name of that villain. And everything he used to say used to be like, Excellent. Ecstatic. I don't know if you guys have seen this, but I'm pretty old and uh, it was pretty funny at that point of time and it used to be one of my favorite series. It used to come at on Star Plus, I think, every evening. And I used to get a beating from my mom by wasting my time in watching those TV series. She obviously didn't know the... Oh, I've taken all the seals. He obviously did not know the legendary status of these characters. Damn, it's Mother's Day today. I wanted to get them some pizza, but they are taking care of their health and they declined the pizza offer. Oh, you have to come all the way up here. Ape not effective in this area, I obviously know that.
Give him 500 bucks. We don't need your kind here. The fucking mosquitoes in this place, man. Money, money, money. Whoa. There are so many. Where the hell am I right now? Can I go somewhere closer to this place? I think this will be closer any day. Shut up about your money. Dun, dun. So I'll not do any of the messenger or the chase missions in this game because honestly I've never done them. But uh, already I've got zero subscribers and creating any of those content will not get me anywhere. Money, money, money. So I uh, first go to Monterey journey. I've got an early morning sales review tomorrow. I know for a fact I'm going to get screwed. All the more reason for me to build an alternate career, guys. Help me over here. Poison and medicine vials. That should heal quickly now. Yeah, thank you. Let me repair. Weapons. Sword of Altair. How do I equip it? I think. Well satisfied. I know it. Allowed to go into Villa Auditori and select that weapon over there. Forza. Captain Sword. Where is the Vila? Where's my proper sword? Okay, that's all the armor. Okay, I don't know why I should look at all of this. Uh, I basically have to go downstairs, unlock the final key. Sword of Altair. Oh, Leonardo is also here. Leonardo, Ezio, so good to see you. How can I help you? Haha, -ha, you found another one. Haha, exciting. I like his excitement every time that he gets a good next page. This goes down here, I take that up there and blend it with... Uh, I've got it. Okay. Unhealth square gained. But I think I would have now got all... Yes, I do. 
And first let's get the armor and then I'll come back to this place. Try to figure out if I can put this. The final piece. You know, this is the one thing Awesome, awesome. Thank you, Altair, for this great gift. May it shield me from my enemies. Amazing. Yes. So like I was saying, uh, this is the one thing that Assassin's Creed Unity screwed up on. And that was uh, the armor that you get after solving all those shitty puzzles. It was absolutely stupid. Little page. Let's see if we can put them in place. Uh, rotate. How do I rotate this? Uh Shit! What the hell am I doing? Okay. India. I hope India is in the right place. What is this supposed to mean, guys? These are the different locations where I think assassins have set up base. Okay. I think everything is in order and we should it was just a map let's see if we can put some feathers back did you see this? This is a new painting that's kind of entered the villa. It was not there earlier on. All those paintings over there get added as... Forty-one of hundred. Oh, this is Mother's Day. So happy Mother's Day over here. Now I'll go back to Foley. Absolutely love how he turns at the last moment. Yes. Once I go to Foley, I'm going to stop this video, guys, because uh, I'd like to keep shorter videos so I'm able to upload them much faster. Beautiful. Polly Docks. 
I think there was another assassin's tomb in this place. I don't know if it was an additional one or... Let's see, we'll find out. Uh, oh, oh, there was no... Oh, yes, here it is. Like you said. Special memory. I'm going to come back to this memory in the next game. Thank you so much for watching this video. I know none of you have watched this video because I've got zero subscribers. I keep watching my own videos in an attempt to get some self-respect. Uh, but uh, just kidding. I'm just kidding, guys. But uh, look forward to your likes and subscribes. Uh, the first subscriber, obviously, uh, will be a really special one. And uh, please hit the, hit the bell icon. And look forward to giving more entertaining videos on this amazing series, which is Assassin's Creed. I hope Ubisoft is watching my videos. You know, I'm a great fan of Ubisoft, and this should. Uh, I'm a great fan of Ubisoft for Assassin's Creed, let me put it like that. And other games as well, but this is a game that I've played the most. Thank you so much. This is Jun Kaki signing off. Look forward to talking to you tomorrow. Bye bye.